New at six, a Metro East school district now under fire after a former high school teacher published a book online detailing a relationship that he had with his female student. Five on your sides, Holden Kerwicki has more from Granite City, where parents and advocates alike are now demanding accountability. In 2018, teacher Andrew Kreider resigned from Granite City High School after it was revealed he was having an affair with a then 18-year-old student. Now many in the community are asking if the district is doing it enough to protect students after Kreider published an online tell-all. It's pretty gross. I was uh, dumbfounded. Why would he post this? That's the reaction Devin Austin and Stacy Johnson had after reading parts of Room270.com, which recounts intimate details of Kreider's relationship with a female student who later took out a restraining order against him. The book was a lot to take in. At the time of Kreider's resignation, then Granite City Superintendent Jim Greenwald told KSDK the relationship was conducted off school grounds, but the book says otherwise. He's got a lot of explicit details in there about a classroom that I once sat in for two years. Greenwald said he contacted authorities on June 7th of 2018 after he found out about the relationship. But according to the book, at least two teachers and one administrator were aware weeks earlier. If you have a suspicion, it might have, it could have, it may happen, you have to report it. Since the girl was 18 at the time, Granite City Police ultimately cleared Kreider of any wrongdoing. In the state of Missouri, it is illegal for a teacher to have a relationship with a student, even if that student is of age and can consent to that relationship. Um, per my research, that law does not exist in Illinois. However, Illinois law requires all educators to immediately report any potential wrongdoing or face misdemeanor or even felony charges. I think it needs to be addressed uh, people need to be charged if they didn't say anything. In a statement sent to the media and families Friday, Granite City superintendent said the district is planning an extended training prior to the upcoming school year, adding that the district has and will continue to act immediately to investigate, appropriately deal with, and notify the proper authorities with any potential safety threat to students. Well, then where was it when this happened? They have to get better before my kids go to the high school or else We'll be starting freshman year in a new school district. At KSDK, we're focused on telling stories in your community. So if there's something newsworthy happening where you live, send us an email to tips at ksdk.com. Reporting in Granite City, Holden Kerwicki, five on your side. Now, we did reach out to Andrew Kreider multiple times for comment on this story. He declined our requests for an interview. We have confirmed with the Illinois State Board of Education that he is no longer licensed to teach in Illinois. You can read the school district's full statement on this incident at KSDK.com. Just look for this story under the As Seen on TV section.